and welcome to video number two of our Grow Your Voice series. This time we're going to do some posture and breathing work. So let's make sure that we all know what general good posture for singing feels like. We want to try and get our bodies into alignment and to help us with this we're going to do a little exercise. We can do this standing or sitting. So let's find our parallel feet, relaxed knees from last time, relax your shoulders and we're going to breathe in and bring our arms up to our shoulders. Breathe out and twist your hands. Breathe in and take them over to your head and breathe out and twist. Breathe in and back to your shoulders and breathe out and down. You should feel that lovely sense of alignment and good posture. We always want to return this feeling of alignment. Breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. Lovely. So, we want to make sure that we are keeping our shoulders nice and relaxed throughout. A very common thing is that we tend to breathe in like this, like we were in primary school, but this can lead to a high breath, which means that we're not using the full potential of our body. So to encourage a lower breath, place one hand on the chest and one on the belly, and when you breathe in, you should feel your belly expanding, but your chest staying pretty much where it is. This is a good exercise to do if you're not quite sure what a low breath feels like. First, we're gonna get rid of all of our air and then we're gonna have a bit of a cough at the end, like this. And then we're just gonna relax our abdomen and allow the breath to just flow in. Lovely. And you should now feel that lovely sort of Christmas belly food feeling. We do that one more time. <laughs> Lovely. That is what a low breath should feel like. Low and slow breathing has been shown to trigger your vagus nerve. The vagus nerve is the longest nerve in your body. It connects your brain to many important organs throughout the body, including the gut, intestines, stomach, heart and lungs. I don't know where my heart and lungs are. One of the main ways that you can stimulate the healthy function of the vagus nerve is through deep, slow belly breathing. You can learn to use breathing exercises to shift your focus away from stress or pain. So now we're going to do some gentle abdominal, do some gentle abdominal, abdominal. So now we're just going to do some gentle abdominal exercises. Place your thumbs on your belly button and rest your hand on your belly and repeat after me. Brilliant. That's it for our second video. We'll see you next time.